Hi everyone, I'm here to talk to you about how to set up and, and take an honor lock exam. So one of the things that you'll need to have is an external webcam. Okay, so you can see in the mirror here, my external webcam. And I'm setting it up on this mason jar because that gives it a little bit of height, which then allows me to point it down at my workspace. So if it was sitting on the desk, you really wouldn't be able to see the workspace very well. Um, although right now I have it pointed a little low, so it's hard to see my face. So the other thing that helps with that is giving a little bit of distance. So it's about, I'd say it's about two feet to the left of my mon uh, laptop here. All right, so when you go to take your honor lock exam, you'll start off um, by logging into Canvas and, and starting the quiz, and it'll launch honor lock and it'll ask you for your ID. So you'll show your ID to the camera, and then it will ask you to do a room scan. So you'll pick up your webcam and you can show, see, my desk. There's nothing else on my desk here. Oh, there's a note here. Um, it just has my list. I'm trying to clean out my email. Um, but that I should get off of there. And then you can see I didn't put any answers on the wall, no equations or anything on the wall over there. I do have some junk down at the end of my desk, um, but that's there. You can see my bookshelf behind me. Um, you can see on the floor here, there is a periodic table, but I'm getting ready to take a physics exam, so that's not useful. Um, nothing on the floor over here. Um, there's some phone numbers. Okay but nothing I would use to cheat on a physics exam. And so then you finish your room scan, and you get the webcam set back up. Make sure again, you can see your face, you can see your desktop. All right, so you're getting ready to start. If you're allowed to have an equation sheet or a periodic table or whatever, show it to the camera, show both sides, make sure the whole thing's visible from top to bottom, side to side no handwritten information on there. Uh, if you're allowed to have any other things, you know, like in this Physics 111 class, you can have a problem-solving template as an example. Okay, blank paper, show both sides. Okay, and then once the exam starts, you're just using the stuff that's up here. Um, let's say you had thought you had plenty of paper and you ran out and then you have to reach for another piece of paper. Well, when you do that, and you reach out of view, and you pick something up, just show it to the camera, okay? If you're doing anything where you're looking into your lap, that's going to be suspicious. So don't look in your lap. Don't look down onto the floor because that's what students do when they're, when they're up to no good. So just keep everything right here. Like I said, most students are, are doing their own work and are not making any efforts to cheat. So we just wanna see that um, and that's, that's all this allows. And that makes it a level playing field because if you're doing your own work and, and other people are able to cheat, then that's not fair to you. So that's why we do this. All right, if you have any questions, just reach out to your instructor and they'll be happy to help you. Um, and if there's any problems during the exam, the honor lock representatives will be there to assist you if they don't resolve something to your satisfaction, just talk to your instructor. Good luck.